Okay guys, so today we are back and as you can see from the screen, we are choning. I said choning. Choning 10th Dan. I'm already fucking up, but I don't care. Because I'm, I'm recording this video. I'm not No cuts, no nothing. Well, we might cut while the game's loading. But today we're going to be doing our special joning promotion battle. Hopefully we can win. I was playing Fortnite with Steven last night and I hit 10th Dan. And I, I was like, you know what? I'll just pre-record the game and talk over the game. Because I tried to do my promotion battle. I lost. So I think I have to be recording because I choked it twice now. So hopefully I don't choke it. Well, one of them I think was a disconnect. Not too sure about that. This is my team, as you can see here. I think this might be the same team that I was running last PvP session. I'm not too sure. I was going to do a video showcasing the CM2 Sasuke as uh, like the body CM2 Sasuke here for the PvP. Still might do that, but uh, we're going to do this promotion battle first. So I'm going to see. First, right, look at that. I, I love when that pops up, but I also hate it. First, let's make sure we're recording, actually. Are we recording? Yes, we are recording. You might have saw my emails there. I don't give two shit. Really? Who are we facing? Yagami. Oh, dude. Okay, so he has some speed. Oh, okay. I think I know what he's doing. I, I may have lost this one. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so please let me... Okay, thank God I outsped. There we go. Let's go. Can we get him in the poison? Yes, we can. Let's go ahead and do this one. I'm just doing this so that way moderate don't miss okay I don't think he has a actually any do dodges on his team which is good and I didn't get what I wanted I was trying to make sure to where his moderate and his my guy wouldn't get any chakra recovery for a while but unfortunately that did not happen what is he gonna do he's gonna hit all three of me we're gonna get all knocked into the poison not too big of a deal really for me anyway we're gonna go ahead and switch. Oh, do I want to do this though? You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and do it so I don't have to worry about his moderator. Might be a big mistake because now he has two options here though. His moderator is dead, and he has the option of using either using Uchitaka to kill off my the chakra sealer or to kill off my killer bee. Either one, I'm not too mad about because next turn with Haku coming in. Well, when my um Super Two comes in, I'm gonna switch Haku back out. Okay, so Haku's already out. Which, um, since he's gonna kill this guy off, it's not that big of a deal. For the reason that now he's out of a jutsu and my Haku's gonna outspeed his Sasuke, unless he kills off my Haku here with his my guy. I forgot, I completely forgot about that my guy. This might be a GG, boys. This actually might be a GG. This guy's team is pretty solid. This guy's team is actually pretty fucking solid, man. Oh, it didn't kill me. Oh, thank God it did not kill me. Oh, thank you so much for that. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. Uh, unfortunately, Madara did not have his Jutsu, which is kind of saddening, but it's not the end. Haku, of course, outspeeds. We're going to go ahead and just, of course, use Haku to get a Ultra Combo all but Haku is dead. I don't really care, though. Madara actually low-key may die. Madara may die. Killer B's not going to outspeed them. This is a choke. This is a choke. This team is, was better than mine in every way. It, was, it has three skill units, and I have three body units. So, this is not going to be good for me. He's going to ultra combo. Oh, he's jutsuing Killer B. What? Okay. Okay, then. He's going to kill off my Killer B more than likely. More than likely, I would kill off my Killer B. I think that's why he went ahead and used the Jutsu on Killer B to see, um, uh, to go ahead because he knew that his one tail wouldn't actually kill my Killer B. So now Killer B is definitely dead. And but can we outspeed this way though? We can actually. So who do I want to go for though? Who do I want to go for? Let's go right here actually. Let's go right here. So that way we can at least get the Ultra Combo off some. Got the slip damage there. Utataka's out. Utataka can practically just... He can just hit my Haku and kill me. Yeah, okay. Okay, we choked it. We did choke it. 
That guy's team was actually really solid. Was not expecting to have that many skill units on his team. I've actually been thinking about revamping my team for a little bit because since I do have a lot of body units on my team, it does bring me at a disadvantage when it comes to everyone else because a lot of people are using that one tail and a lot of people are actually using that Yamato nowadays and that Yamato is really good because he does a shit ton of damage. He's pretty much like another Utataka. So, you know, we're going to keep stick with this team. We're going to go for one more run because we got another great promotion battle. Was not expecting to choke it like that, but I did give it my best and that guy's, other, that guy's team was pretty good. That guy's team was pretty good and he did outplay me. And why do I keep getting special Jonings? Why? Why do I get the special Jonings? No, I know I'm about to be a special Joning. Like legit, okay, so I've been in tuning for a while now, okay? And I have probably only faced tunings a handful of times. Every time I play a game, it's always special Joning, Joning. I've even, I think I faced one Ambu before. I think I actually faced an Ambu before. I'm not too sure about that, but I, I just, it's not fun. <laughs> I want to face my ranks. Okay, so I should outspeed here unless he did the same thing I did. He did not. That is cool. That is cool. That is cool. Let's go ahead and knock her right on into the poison. Hopefully, Chakra Seal the Bravery Sasuke. Please, Chakra Seal. Damn it. Okay, well, at least we get Karin's Chakra Seal. We don't have to worry about her getting an ultimate for a little bit. So he's probably going to switch out to his Madara. Uh, his Bravery Sasuke is going to actually outspeed my Sasuke. Which I don't know why he has more speed than me. But I'm not complaining. Not complaining. Hopefully he comes down here so I can ultra combo his ass into the poison. Uh, I think I can still actually hit him and Haku actually. Loki? I can. There we go. Normally I would go for Karin. But since I can actually hit two people here... That Bravery Sasuke is actually a really big problem for me for the fact that that Sasuke can immobilize and then I can go ahead and hit like this as long as they don't I don't get a miss with Bravery I won't, yeah with the Shidori Sasuke should be fine I did not get a miss Karin's in the poison Haku's did we got two of them out Karin is actually legit almost did but he's gonna combo me back into the poison and then it's going to be Karin. I'm going to hit with two Jutsus back to back. I actually may lose two units here. I may lose Madara and CM2 here. Not a huge deal if I do. Because I'm going to outspeed him. Oh, he just switched. That was surprising. Um... That was really surprising. Uh, I did not expect him to do that. Let's knock him into the poison real quick. Because now, I'm outspeed his Sage of Six Path Naruto. He doesn't have dodges. And he's dead. That first game, I was... Wait, can I hit him? There we go. Okay. Oh, no! No! Don't tell me I choked this. Don't tell me I'm going to choke this. Can I get a miss? Oh no, I just missed. Okay, fucking shit, man. Can we like combo him to death, maybe? Can we like combo him to death? I think that's my like my only choice right now. Well, actually, I could probably pick this up and get an attack up. And then I just have to survive one hit, and then I win. Yeah, that's all I'm gonna do. Okay. I, I know I probably couldn't have hit him to death. The only thing I have to do now is survive a moderate ninjutsu, which I can definitely do easily. The, actually, the only one I would have to really worry about surviving is Sage of Six Paths. And then I just have to outspeed his Sage of Six Paths. I should be able to survive this easily. The only way I will die is combo hitting and poison. Combo hitting and poison would kill me, actually. That was close. But now Haku's out, and I definitely got out speed. There we go. I definitely win this one now. I definitely won. And please just do enough damage to kill Modder. Please. Please and thank you. Thank you so much. There we fucking go. 
Oh, that was... <laughs> the first guy outplayed me. First guy, I completely understand why he won. He outplayed me in every way. His team had a really big advantage on my team. For the fact, like I said, because he had three skill units, the so skill units could easily wipe out all my really big damage dealers. And there we go, boys. There we go. That team right there, he shouldn't even get that close to beating me for the fact that I misclicked. Technically misclicked twice. Because when I picked up the the attack boost, I wasn't sure if like, do I want to pick this up or do I want to hit Madara? And time ran out on me, so I count that as a misclick, but it still worked out in my favor. And then that Killer B, y'all saw it, I, I was up there, and then I let go, and since I'm playing on a phone, when I let go, I guess the heat signature for my finger moved it down some when I lifted my finger, and it moved Killer B down. But there we go, Special Joning First Dan. Took me a lot longer than I thought it was, but it took me a lot less time than it took me in the preseason. So this has been Season 1, Episode 2, Special Joning Match. There we go. I think I might now, since I'm in Special Joning, I might get my Dan's up a couple times and then actually try out a couple of different teams, showcasing a couple special characters. But I do have to limit break them, but I'm going to try my best to do that. Oh, real quick announcement, by the way. Probably won't be no Limit Break Chronicles episode this Monday. Uh, I've been slacking on the limit breaks. Actually, I limit broke in Haku all the way without actually recording it. Forgot to. My fault. I'm sorry. So there probably won't be one this Monday. But the question I'm going to leave you with today is who is your favorite PvP unit to use? As in your favorite Naruto Ultimate Ninja Blazing unit to use in PvP. Try to exclude using CM2 Sasuke and one Naruto as your answers, but if you do, that is fine. My favorite currently is that Renegon Sasuke. He is amazing. He clutches it all the time. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like. Let me know your rank down in the comment section below. Anyway, guys, I'll see you the fuck later. Peace.